Just across the way, the Tampa Theater is looking for help. The historic building is almost 100 years old, and it brings about $8 million in economic impact to Tampa every year. And you can still catch a movie there to this day, but the theater is showing your age. ABC Action News reporter Chad Mills found out what it needs to survive another century. It's one of Tampa's jewels. I can guarantee anybody that walks into this building, there is always a reaction. Because Tampa Theater is one of the world's best movie theaters. Nobody walks into Tampa Theater and kind of shrugs. It's also a time machine to 1926 when it was built and to this day. The first time I visited Tampa Theater was on a field trip in high school. Continues to mesmerize people like Joe Watecki, whose job is to now make others fall in love with watching movies in this ornate auditorium. There's no finer experience. But Tampa Theater has a problematic secret. Behind the scenes, it's falling apart. The basements that we have in this building, the dressing rooms, the support spaces, and the infamous third floor. Up here, there are holes in the ceilings and old brick walls being held together by pins. Downstairs, the technology used to project movies is showing its age. Other problems are popping up too. Just earlier today, our popcorn machine threw a rod. So Tampa Theater has a fundraising goal, $42 million. Wateki says half of that would help modernize the theater's technology and allow it to offer the community more. The other half will help maintain it. This needs to be saved. This needs to be helped. This is a landmark in Tampa. Late last week, a branch of Tampa government committed to $14 million of the tab, but now the theater is looking for more help from the state, from the county, and from its donors. If all goes as planned and the community does step up, Wateki says this jewel will be fully restored before it turns 100 in 2026. Grandma is beautiful at 97, but wait till you see what grandma looked like when she was a young woman. Of course, Tampa Theater is looking for generous corporate and private donors, but they say the best way the average person can support the restoration efforts here, coming to see a show or a performance, buying a ticket at the box office. At Tampa Theater, Chad Mills, ABC Action News.